one thing, okay, because the step back to uh, double shake feet and six ceiling for closing, uh, they are the same in one thing that I'm going to talk about. Your movements did not uh, untie a knot. So uh, I'll explain and then I'll show you. The, once you understand this here, the circle in this view means you tie a knot and then untie it. And you do it in a way that before the knot is secure, it ties a dead knot, it's open again. So you look at the arm, both arms, and my chest. This is a knot. You understand this now? Okay. So remember, just to lock this view, this image into the word, this is a knot. So if you're in a box, like a small room, and the people push you, you go like this, now you're cornered. That's called a knot. You have nowhere to go. So as you do this here, this can you see is one beat. You do half of it, half of it. Now watch again, this is one beat, it's finished. You do half of it. At this time, your arms stop, your chest continues. Now you have undone the knot. And now watch again. When your arms move again, you open it. Otherwise, can you see you are caught? Do you understand that? This move is fundamental. This is the primary function of six ceiling for closing in training your foundations, not application. So you see here, six ceiling for closing, you pretend to do this. Your opponent can feel with the sensitivity, he got you cornered because your movement is double heavy. Can you see if your opponent follows you, follows you at a certain point, if there's a wall behind you, he cornered you, pasted you on the wall, you can't move anymore. So you actually go like this, and then, can you see that half, you went like that. And then, at this point, you actually are totally open to return. If you are like this, you can't return. Now, can everybody understand this now? I've been talking about this for a long time. I hope one day you understand this is why in Taiji you look like you're making moves. Actually, your moves are totally opposite of what your opponent thinks you're ma making. Every move you make, he thinks he got you, but you, he never got you. This is the move I said is like a baby. When you try to carry a baby, if a baby uses power, can you see you got him? But the baby does this, so you can't get him. So to speak, hold your arm and do this. And you, you remember in foundations, we've been working on this for a long time. Yeah. It unties the knot. 